Hello everyone and welcome back to Dragon Age Origins. We are in some underground tunnel system. We are looking for Jarvia, the leader of the Karta in Orzammar. And also we are looking for um, uh, some chests that have the stuff in them. <laughs> Jammer's common box. Yes, right. We were supposed to um, We got the letter opener out of this Now I, I had asked you guys last episode um, To let me know if you knew anything about this Quest, but I guess none of you knew anything because I didn't get any response to my question So we'll have to figure it out still so last episode we couldn't figure out what was, or I couldn't, I should say, I couldn't. I couldn't figure out which one was the cheapest or least expensive item in the last chest. Whether it was a silver ring or a um, emerald ring. <clears throat> and I still don't know the answer to that one. <laughs> so, anyway, let's continue on. We're going about to go through this door. Um... Yeah. Okay, we'll go through the door. Ooh, big crystals. Looks like they were harvesting them, maybe? Oh, wait a minute. Did we already come in this direction? Hold on, are we going back the way we can't know we're going the right way that just looked like a body that we might have killed or maybe they just, just just bones I guess okay but after you kill the bodies they sometimes turn into piles of bones like them all right more enemies ahead ah, caught a thumbs. you guys bring them bring them this way there we go Come on. Oh yeah, backstab. Come on. We're doing good. We're not taking any damage. All right. Well, that was odd. One of us slid to the side, and I'm not sure who it was. Alistair, you've got something going on with you. What is that? What is that red ring that goes around him, I wonder? If it's some sort of uh, spell, or a... Um... I was gone now, I was gonna check to see what it was on his status, uh, uh, status but yeah, it was too late. Oh, there's more of them in here. Oh, they have a mage. It is begun. Oh, he's already stunned. By the maker. I shall do it. Oh, come on! Missed. Did you just get your health back? Oh, hey, we should probably get her. Whoa! I just decapitated her? Wow, that was fun. Yeah. Oh, nice. <laughs> nice. A barrel? Short bow. Excuse me, Alistair. <clears throat> I don't actually want to talk to you. Okay. Lots of duster leather armors. Um, oh, there's no one there. Ah, Peak's uh, common box. Right, okay. Let's go t loot the other thingies first. Wanna... Some monies. Oh, I thought there were more bodies. I guess not. Okay. Peak's common box. A fl flower spar trinket, a garnet trinket, and a malachite trinket. 
Well, seriously, how in the world am I supposed to know which one's more valuable? I don't even know what's more valuable in real life, let alone in their economy. <laughs> right? Uh, I really don't know. I feel like a garnet might be less. Hmm. But I'm not positive about that. I'm not sure what flower spar is. If that's a real mineral or not. I know malachite and garnet is. I've found garnets before. They're not that rare. Malachite, I've never found that before. I've never even heard of flower spar. So it could be the garnet. Hmm. Shall I try looting the garnet one? Hmm. I wonder if these are just in alphabetical order. I was I was starting to wonder if um, they were in any particular order. I don't think they are. All right, I'm not sure what flower spar is. But I think garnets aren't as valuable as malachite. But I have no idea about flower spar. Floor spar? I don't know how to pronounce that. Hmm. All right, well, you know what? Let's just take it and see. Ah. Nothing happened. Except, you know, it made a door unlocking sound. Alright. <clears throat> We're going this way. Yells. Oh, yeah. I wanted to just save. <laughs> just do a little save. Just in case. I don't, I don't want to have to do any of these battles over again on screen because it's just annoying having to do that for the video. All right, let's get on the shortest tunnel first. This is what I like to do. What now? Oh, it's locked. Ooh. What? Ah! Right. No, look now. <laughs> that actually startled me. I don't know. This one. I shall do it. Come on. I can't seem to lock onto. Huh, okay. Chest, just randomly I, down here. I put the dwarven helmet. Okay, and there's a big job off there. Wonderful. Okay. What are these caves for, I wonder? <laughs> this door was already open. I wonder why.
Okay. Got it? Got them all. Alright. What are these things? Oh, Malachite. <laughs> Look at that. Um, I, you're, you can stand on one, Alistair. What are they? Ew. They have creepy looking faces. Like little worm heads. I think I remember these things. I don't remember what they're called, though. I remember... I remember them being in um, Dragon Age Inquisition better, because, yeah. I think that's the most recent of the uh, Dragon Age games that I played before I started this playthrough. And so, I think I remember them from that better than from here. What is this thing? Huh. Interesting. So they keep animals back here for some reason. Not sure why. Wonder why these are dead. Ooh. A fancy base. Oh, jammer stash box. Okay, we need to go get the other thing from it, though. The other thing, right? Because I don't think we can unlock this. No, I cannot. Yeah. We need the three items, and we don't have the one. I have to decide which item is least expensive. Or worth the least, or something like that. A metal door. Oh. Autosave, huh? That means there's something bad behind this door. Potentially. Man, it keeps going still after this chamber. This is crazy. I'm not going to remember about that. I'm going to completely forget about Jammer's stash box, aren't I? You know what? I'm going to go back and get one of the items from, from the other box that we passed that we left behind here I don't remember where it was exactly it was the, it was the first box we found wasn't it and it was a long way back let me see it was like back in one of those original side rooms okay I'll uh yeah <laughs> Okay, <clears throat> it was in one of these side rooms. But I don't remember which one. Not this one, I think. Okay. Maybe while we're down here, we should go through that other little area that we missed last time. Is this it? Yes, Kinky's Common Box. All right, emerald costume ring, gold costume ring, or silver costume ring. Which one is the least expensive? I feel like maybe it might be the silver one because if it's just plain silver, it probably wouldn't be worth as much as a ring that has an emerald on it, right? That's what I'm kind of guessing, but I could be wrong. I mean, I don't even know what they consider valuable. Uh, maybe it's just the same as what we consider valuable, but who knows? I'm just gonna take the silver costume ring and See how it goes. I mean like for instance in a game like Skyrim a silver ring would cost less than an emerald ring normally Then a ring with a gem on it. So I'm taking the silver ring All right, I mean nothing bad happened to me yet <laughs> It's supposed to happen when I Use the items as a key, right? That's what I gathered. Alright, so there was... Yes, this door down here. We didn't go down here. No, no, no. Not that door. It was what? Wrong, wrong direction. The other way. No, no, this way. Yeah, that door. It was that door down there. Right. We didn't go in that. It was a... It's just, <clears throat> it looks like a single chamber or something down here. So, why don't we go ahead and go through the, oh, yep, there's going to be Carta thugs in there, apparently. 
Oh, they have a mage! Okay. I'm trying to lead some of them out here. So that... Alistair, are you staying with me? Somebody heal him. Okay, good. Come on, come on. What do we have in here? Let's go get some of these people. No, they have a... Mm, that's a trap. Hold on, Alistair, don't run through it. Okay. Oh, it... He resisted it. He resisted it, and then he didn't resist it. Okay. It is big. It shall be done. Come on. It is begun. It is begun. I have begun to attack. Uh, okay, there we go. There we go. Is this their treasure hoard? Or oh, they have a weapon stand? A mace. Small shield. And what else? A chest. Okay, we're, Task is finished. we're getting a lot of runes in this trip. Maybe we can donate them to the cause because most of them are novice runes. There we go. Um, one more guy to, to loot. There we go. Okay, <clears throat> let's head back. And see if we can open that chest, hopefully, and not get blown up or fingers cut off or something like that. <laughs> Alright, okay, there it is. We are here. Alright. Hopefully, it doesn't wake up these nasty creatures. Hehe. <laughs> Win. I don't want to activate you. Okay. Alright. We'll try it. It looks like we can unlock it, but. I don't know. Finished. <gasps> it worked. <laughs> I guess right. I guess seven sovereigns. Seven and a half sovereigns. And a long runner's cap. Wait a minute. Oh yeah, no, I took all. Okay, let's take a look at... Uh, wrong button. Let's take a look at the cap. Let's see what it is. See what kind of thing it is. Long runner's cap. Light helmet. Hmm. It's the same one. Same. Same as mine, except it has a different. Yeah. Plus one stamina regeneration in combat. And my other one has plus three physical resistance. Hmm. I'm not sure which one is better. Which one do you guys think is better? Physical resistance or plus one stamina regeneration? I'll wait and find out what you guys say. I'm just kind of tickled that I guessed those correctly. <laughs> Considering that, like, literally two of them was just a guess. I was pretty sure about the other one, but the other two were kind of just guesses because I had no idea. Especially the, the one with the, um... The one with the, uh, uh, the minerals. I had no idea which minerals were more valuable. Okay, let's go in here. Oh, uh, yes, I had a feeling she would be back there. That's her, isn't it? I'm gonna make a save right here first. Because I have a feeling... This might be a tough fight, if we do indeed fight. Hello? So, Paramount finally realized we're taking the city, yet he still can't be bothered to send his own men. Will you pick the wrong side, stranger? It doesn't matter who's king, as long as there's a queen! Oh. Yes. Hmm... I was hired to take her out, right? Not to bargain with her or 
anything like that. Their arms are too long, aren't they? I just felt like they are. Okay. Um, yes, uh, surrender, and I'll spare your life. Hardly convincing when your blades are covered in my men's blood. Kill them, but leave the pretty one alive. I have plans for her. Oh, really? Clint, there's a trap in here. I'm not sure where it's at. Oh, there it is. Oh, I totally missed that one. I was going for the one in front of her. I didn't see this one. Oh. Oh darn. Oh darn, Alistair. Um and me! <gasps> I forgot to make potions. Hmm. That's not good. I forgot to make potions. I mean, I can make them in the middle of a battle. Alistair, how come you're not taking the the potion? Oh, I switched to him on accident. Take another one. There, there we go. Okay. We must fight! Wind, get out of the way! She's just standing here. Where can you go? Just come back here a little further. You don't need to stand right in the way. Oh no. I'm dead. I'm actually dead. I'm a dead person walking. Look at that. Yep, I'm dead. Okay. And she's after wind. She's after wind. We gotta get her. Why am I walking backwards? Oh no, wind just went down. Okay. This is a tougher fight. Yeah, Jarvi is tough. She's gonna. I'm slow. I'm going to wear your pretty, pretty teeth around my oh. wrist. Yeah, I am. Okay, Morgan right. is still right. stunned. No one tell them to and live. Oh my God. Right. Yeah. Okay. Morgan, you might as well just die right now. I, you know? You're gonna just, yeah, let's just let her die. It's, it's no use. Okay. <laughs> Good thing I saved, right? Okay. <laughs> so, Haramod finally realized we're taking the city, yet he still can't be bothered to send his own men. Okay. Well, you pick the wrong side, stranger. It doesn't matter who's king, as long as there's a queen. All right. Let's pick a different thing. You're awfully cocky for someone whose entire carter is dead. You'll pay for their deaths a hundred times over. Kill them, but leave the pretty one alive. <laughs> I have plans for her. I wonder if you can actually get. Enemy I wonder if you actually can get out of this fight or not. I wish I had bombs. I, I wish I had bombs. I do want to put some potion or um poison on my thing. What do I have? What do I have? I have a grease trap and I have acidic coating. Let's do death. Oh, 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 we need to whittle down her guys, I think. Okay, Alistair. Uh, wrong button. Take a thing. Don't go around that way. 
Oh, there wasn't even a... Oh, the string wasn't even visible. I died. No, Alistair died. Okay. That's not good. It, it, yeah. Oh, no, no, no. Let's get the one that's getting more again. Oh, she, she got it. Fine. Okay. Go. Mm. Ah! Kill me! Kill me! I can't. I can't. I'm dead. Oh, I'm dead. It's, uh, I'm dead. <laughs> oh, no. Um, yeah, okay. Uh, there's too many things. There's too many things. Okay, I'm gonna skip the dialogue this time. So, Paramount finally realized we're if taking the city. I can't. Yet he okay. still can't be bothered to send his own men. Will you pick the wrong side, stranger? It doesn't matter who's king. All right. As long um, as there's a queen. Just shut up and die already. Ladies first. And I'm no lady. Kill them! Oh. She doesn't even want to save me for ladies. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to deactivate the trap if I can. Ugh. I want to deactivate this trap. There it is. Deactivate the trap. Jarvia? <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> okay, let's take a thing. Alistair, let's take a thing. Ah! She's too tough. She's too tough, you guys. Hmm. Very well. Come on. Okay, got the one. Oh, got him. Okay, good. You got him. Okay, good. Knock her out again. Alistair, let's heal you one more time. Uh, Alright, let's get this guy. Oh, no, Alistair, Alistair. What? Stay here. Stay, stay. Win, 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 win. You need help? Um, you know what? Okay, let's heal her. Take, take a potion. Win. Okay, now, um... Where is it? Here it is. Okay. Take a greater lyrium potion. Alright, Alistair, take one. Okay. Ready. Um, not let's you. Finish. Me. Back to me. There we go. Okay. Oh, Alistair again. We only have one potion left. Oh, and he died. Not good. <laughs> Not good at all. That group heal came a little too late. If we can. Whoa. Okay. Wayne, you need more yes. lyrium, don't you? Okay. Where am I? What am I doing? I'm being healed? I think I'm being healed. As you say. I'm trapped. You holding up there, Morrigan? You are. No! I died! Oh! We almost had her! We almost had her! Okay, no, 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 no. I need to move to Morrigan. Where is she? There's still so many guys in here. Or, well, there's three for sure, and Jarvia, probably. <sighs> okay. Um, yeah, I don't know. Jarvia's gonna come out of nowhere. Run while you can! 
We gotta get her. We got. We gotta get her. We got her. We got her. I think. Unless she just disappeared again. No, we didn't get her. We almost got her. Oh, Wynn's dead. Okay, but Jarvie is... Jarvie is dead. I don't have... I should have, um... Oh, I just totally activated the tripwire. Seriously? Ah! Uh... What? I was sending you first. Very well. Okay, I really need better attack spells. Tear them apart. So be it. Cross me and you Come on, you almost got it. Yes, I one more. Got him. Another corpse for the pile. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> well done, Morrigan. <laughs> okay, we did it. Wow, and we're all injured, I'm sure. I'm curious what our injuries are. Oh, dear. I have a cracked skull. Alistair is deafened. Wynn is deafened and bleeding. Oh, wow. Okay, well, let's take some things. Warden. Uh, oops, wrong button. You don't yes. have an injury. Okay. Let's take... Um... Injury kits. Lesser injury kit. I only had... No, Wynn has two, so she needs a regular injury kit. Always waiting, isn't there? <laughs> <laughs> Alistair, you only have one injury, so you take a lesser injury kit. Done. And I only have one injury, so I take a lesser injury kit. I swear, when this is over... Right? <laughs> okay, we did it, you guys. We killed the Carta, Thugs, and Jarvia. And what does she have on her? Concentrated Soldier's Bane. What does that do? Weapons coated in this potent poison drain targets of their stamina. Although this effect only works against non-spellcasters. Nice. Another long runner's cap. Pushback strikers. Expert silverite rune. And a carta key. Okay. Um, let's take a look at the things real quick before I forget. Um, two, so I now have two long runner's caps. Hmm. Pushback strikers. Drake skin. Gloves. 5% melee critical chance. Hmm. Those are pretty good. I don't know. Mine adds fire resistance. <laughs> but I mean, yeah, because they're the Drake skin gloves. I mean, they're technically both Drake skin gloves, but I don't need fire resistance most of the time. Most mages don't use fire, it seems. Oh, good. We got some health poultice, a garnet. Look at that. <laughs> Another health poultice. Great. But I should make some more right before I forget. What is this? Are you kidding me? There was still a trap that hadn't been triggered. <laughs> I didn't even see it. Uh, this must be the chest I had to key for. Or not. No, that didn't have a lock on Look it. Look there! A cunning trap! I shall do it. Okay, there's still one that I didn't um, trigger. Okay, I've disarmed two of, two of them, triggered two of them. All right, now what's behind these areas? Oh, maybe this unlocks this door. You know what, before I do anything else, I really don't want to have to do that again. It is over. Yes, the key. Okay, let's see it's where this goes. In a circle, apparently. Oh. oh! It goes back! How convenient. Well, I'm glad I went back and got that thing already. Oh, Janner! Gah! By all the beards of my ancestors! How did you... 
Where did you come from? You made a hole in my wall. I made the hole. Oh. <laughs> hmm. That hole leads to a tunnel in the Carter's hideout. It, it does? Oh, sod it. If people find out about this, my business will be ruined. They'll think I have something to do with Jarvia. Hmm. You didn't know about this. No! I don't have anything to do with them. They're criminals. When they built this part of the city, they must have built over some tunnels. I swear, I had no idea. Oh, just leave me alone. I don't want anything to do with this. And if anyone comes asking, I'm going to tell him you get it. Well, I, I don't get a chance to tell him again that... <sighs> Why is there a dead guy laying on the table over there? Did we see him already? Janner, can I talk to you again? You again? Here to buy something, or were you just thinking of wrecking another part of my shop? Oh, yes, uh... Let me see what's in your stall. Of course. Uh, keep in mind, we also take items on trade. Right. I was thinking about selling off a bunch of stuff while I'm at it, right? Okay. Um. <clears throat> whoops. Um. What are these silverite daggers? How are they? They're not anywhere near as good as mine. Definitely not. Okay. Oh, well, that was my sword. <laughs> um, Off-handed weapon. There we go. Um, That's a little... Well... I mean, damage. Base damage is a little better than mine, but man, mine's a lot better. Just because of all the extra stuff it's got. Yeah. So, I don't know if Viridium is... No, Viridium is tier 4. Okay. So, I think I'm just going to sell a few things, you guys, and I will skip that, and I'll be back in a second. Okay, that's it. I sold everything that I could sell, or I saved out a few things because I wasn't sure what the people back at camp had on them. And I'll, uh, I'll sell things to Bodan if nobody needs them. Okay! There, we did it. Okay, now what are we supposed to do? <laughs> Go back and tell somebody, probably. Um. Yes. Return to Haramont. Of course. Okay. <clears throat> Let's do that. Where are we? We're down in the... Yeah, we need to go up here. And go to the, um... Somewhere? We need to go to the... Rich people part of town, right? Yes. Oh, you know what? Hmm. Before we do that, I'm tempted. Where's, where's a merchant? Are any of these merchants actually here? Here, let's talk to this guy. Have you seen my lunch? No. It, it's a piece of lichen bread. I'm, I'm, I'm only asking here, because you never know who's going to I just want to see your wares. Right. Best in the trade, you know. I work the orm up myself. <laughs> okay. Don't get too excited about it. I just wanted to see what he had available because, um, mm, what does that do? I think I probably looked at that once. Ooh, that's nice. I like that, but yeah. I don't even have that many. I almost have that many. I literally almost could buy it, but then that would use up everything that I have. <laughs> oh, he doesn't have any. Oh, darn. I was hoping he had he could sell potions, but he probably can't because he's a dwarf. Do they sell potions here? Wait a minute. I'm on the wrong side of town, right? What's this? No, yeah, Diamond Corner. Okay, heading off to what's his name's house? Adal Helmi. Was she there before? Did I? You have come at a difficult time. Orzammar is ailing for want of a king. I might have talked to her once. That's nothing. Okay. Lord Balin swears revenge on <sighs> Grey Wardens. He is like a mad serpent through dark, they insiders. Oh dear. Okay. 
All right. Do you have a quest for us this time, Doolin? His lordship appreciates your support. That's weird that he has a quest marker over his head still. Paramount! Guess what we did. I heard the news. Oh, what you did? Jarvia and her Carter. Are dead. <sighs> I suppose it was unrealistic to expect them to surrender. Oh, you wanted me to. <laughs> you wanted me to do it peacefully? Yeah. Hmm. It's done. Will you speak to the assembly now? I have no desire to go back on my word. But when Balin heard the news about Jarvia, he raised the stakes. Of course he did. He is forcing a vote in the next two days. By law, that prevents the assembly from hearing any other pleas. To help with your troops, I will require your assistance one last time. Do you know anything of the Paragon Branca? Um, I've heard the name. Branca is a paragon. The only one we have been blessed with in four generations. Two years ago, she took her entire house into the deep roads on a mad quest to uncover ancient secrets. No one's heard from her since. Yes. Were she to return and endorse someone for the throne, the assembly would be honor-bound to accept her wishes. Mm. And... Are you sure Bronca would support you as king? It's hard to say what she would do. She wasn't exactly known for her predictability. She never seemed to like being a paragon. She was devoted to her craft, never cared for politics. But one of the most brilliant minds Orzama has seen. Bronca hated Darkspawn with a passion. She would certainly be a valuable voice to support your treaty. Mm. And what if she's dead? Her entire house went with her. It would take a lot to kill so many. If not, bringing proof of her death or a body to return to the stone would still show that as an ancestor, it was my hand she guided to her remains. Uh-huh. Okay. If it will get you the throne, then I will find Bronca. My men traced Bronca's disappearance to an ancient crossroads known as Caradin's Cross. It is many miles below where we normally venture, hmm. but I can provide a map to lead you there. Just enter the deep roads through the mines. Right. Thank you again. And may the ancestors guide your steps. Okay. Anvil of the Void. A paragon of her kind. Okay, let's take a look at them. Find Paragon Bronca for Lord Haramont. Okay. She's been missing for two years. They followed Bronca's trail to Caradine's Cross. Before it went cold, you should start there. Okay, Anvil of the Void. Head towards Ortan Taig from Caradin's Cross. Bronco was said to be passing that way. Odd that there's two different quests for it. Alright, but before we do any of that... <clears throat> Doolin. His lordship appreciates your support. I know. Um, we need to go restock supplies, like, a lot. <laughs> Because we have nothing left. I want to get some more bombs. I want to... We need to actually... Actually, I can make potions. I just keep forgetting to. Um, okay. I actually do need to make some injury kits. I need deep mushrooms. I don't have any. I bet we'll find deep mushrooms... In the deep roads. <laughs> I'm assuming deep mushrooms are from the deep roads. I, I don't know. Maybe not. I can go buy some probably. But I don't think I'm going to find what I need here. I'm going to go ahead and... What do lyriums use? Okay. I need to make sure I don't use up all the flasks. Well, actually... No, I cannot. What? How much lyrium do I have left? We have 14 lyrium potions. We only have one greater, but... We got 14 regular. I'm going to use up all of them... I'm gonna use up all the flasks. We can get more flasks. I suggest we go back to camp. We can get um, a bunch of stuff from Bowden. So, yeah. Why don't we do that? Why don't we go back to camp? Maybe we can have some conversations with the crew. See what's going on with everybody. We'll see. Because there's just not enough um, merchants here. Or merchants that sell regular goods. Or maybe there's some... Um, 
Oh, yeah, and I need to tell her. Or not tell her, but uh, take her message to the mages. And this woman wanted me to go into the deep roads to find her son. I might as well accept that. Ooh, there's a nug back there. Nug nug. You wrangled a nug in a box. Yes, I did. Filda. We don't have to have the whole conversation. Did you wish here. to make an offering after all? Oh, yes. Um, was there something you wished me to do? My son, Rock, is missing in the deep roads. Right. You seemed sympathetic. It would mean a lot to me to have him back safely. Or even to recover his body for a proper funeral. Right. Okay. Did he leave? What happened to him again? It was five years ago. He was only oh. a youngster. He joined a Deep Roads excursion, the only smith to go with the warriors to repair their arms. He was so proud. Okay. But he got separated somehow. When they came home, he wasn't with them. All right. I was thinking maybe he went with Bronco, but he didn't. Okay. All right. Um, do you want me to look for him? How? There is no way except to brave the Deep Roads yourself. Yes. Actually, I'm on my way there right now. Alone? But that's unheard of. I'm not completely No alone. one risks the deep roads without a full company backing them. But perhaps that explains why one of your kind has come to Orzammar today. If you'd look for my son, if you even find his bones, you'd have my eternal gratitude. Take heart, good widow Filda. We'll do our best. Please, find me as soon as you return. I will. <laughs> okay, there, we got that quest. I don't think there were any other quests that we needed to collect before going into the deep roads themselves. Um, where, where's the out? Where's the, um, yeah, it's this way. Let's go out, outside. Need some fresh air anyways. It's getting stuffy in here. And we'll go back to camp and resupply before we go on the deep roads because there's not going to be any merchants down there. Oh, that's right. There were merchants out here, weren't there? We can check these ones too. And if they're still here. I mean, there were merchants here. Aha. Uh -huh. Yes, indeed. Let's talk to them. All is waiting for a king who will ignore me. The world tests my patience. Oh, he looks like he might sell potions. He's got some bottles and stuff. Oh, but he's... Hmm. The assembly is still deadlocked. My family could starve. Doesn't that mean as much as who is king? I, I am sorry. I should not speak such things aloud. How can I help you? Apparently you can't. <laughs> Never mind. Best of luck to you. Why is he talk to a bull if I can't buy stuff from him? It's so annoying. I do wonder, is it permissible for two Grey Wardens to... Oh, what is the word I search for? Caboodle? Morrigan. Fraternize. What's wrong with fraternizing? It seems most... undisciplined. For an organization that claims it will do whatever is necessary to end the Darkspawn threat. One thing has nothing to do with the other. Oh no? And what if a Grey Warden was forced to choose between the Warden he loved and ending the Blight? What should his choice be? That is a, a ridiculous question. And I have my answer. Most kind of you. <laughs> they seem to pick up on way more than uh, Alistair oh, and Bryn have been letting on. They've just well, been enjoying some conversations. Some conversations. I mean, they have flirted, but... Yeah, not in any kind of serious way. There are literally no merchants out here. I guess I, I think that these there would become merchants out here later after they decide who's king. If one or the other becomes king. I can't remember how it goes. I did not expect it to be this crowded. What? The bridge? Eh? 
Anyway, <clears throat> let's go back to camp, why don't we? I suppose I could have just opened the map and gone there. I don't know if I could have done that. I think I have to choose these little exit spots, world map things. All right, let's go back to camp. And if we can't get everything there, I might head over to the Mages College and uh, get some, because that's just right here. And that's pretty close to, um, you know, if we're going to be, you know, doing like <clears throat> role play wise, they're not that far away compared to like Denerim, for instance. Okay, <clears throat> anyway, camp is wherever we make it. <laughs> All right. All right, I'm going to go do stuff first. I'm going to check to see if any of the items that I saved will work for any of these people. And then I'm going to go buy supplies and sell anything that didn't work for our people. And I will be right back, you guys. All right, I'm done. So... I did some things. I replaced, I think, Liliana's hat and Zevran's hat with the two hats that I found already, that I just found recently. Um, and I gave Sten the Dwarven Massive Boots, because they were way better than the boots he had. And I think I also gave him a new sword, which was better than the one he had. And, uh... Yeah, mostly the stuff that we found was junk. <laughs> and so I just sold it. But I also picked up quite a lot of runes on that trip. Since we were down in the dwarf lands and they do the rune thing, right? Um, <clears throat> so here's what I did. For my sword, Merrick's Blade, I added a six, plus six damage versus dark spawn rune on there. Since we are going down the deep roads i figured that that might be useful and i put um plus two damage versus dark spot on my dagger so that's what i did for that and then for alistair on duncan's sword i put two dark spawn runes which adds up to six damage versus dark spawn all right that is what i did on those i didn't change anybody else's even though I do have more runes, but they're not coming with me. I'm going to take my usual crew. I'm... I'm... Yeah, I think I like Alice. I think I like the combination of Alistair, Wynn, and uh, Morrigan. Because it's... Uh, it just works. I, I, I feel like I have more success in fights that way. Alright, so I was going to put some um, supply supplies in here. I was going to... Turn in runes for the circle. I was going to give all novice runes. Because I don't need to use those. And then I was going to um, give the um, the journeyman runes. Because I don't have any. I mean, I have some. But I don't want to use any of them. I don't need them. And I don't actually have any master runes. The one darkspawn rune that I put... What is crafting materials for the Dalish? What do they want? Oh. Yeah, no, I need all that stuff. You got Even the Templars will be impressed by the powers you will command. I hope so. <laughs> Anyways, I said I was going to do conversations. Um, after I was done selling stuff. But you guys, it's, it's late. I've, my, <laughs> the episode's an hour long now, approximately, almost an hour, and I would like to uh, not make it go over an hour. I really don't want to, because if I stop right now, then I can record another episode immediately after this, and that's good for me. <laughs> okay, anyways, let me know what you think about that, oh, I don't remember what it was now. I remember wanting to know what your opinion was on something that we picked up. What was it? Uh, whoops. No, how do you switch between? There we go. <laughs> there, these uh, pushback strikers. Right. 
What do you think is better? Which one do you think is better? The Wade Superior Drake Skin Gloves with plus one dexterity and plus 10% fire resistance, or the Pushback Strikers with plus 5% melee critical chance. I did not get rid of these because I wasn't sure. I mean, I guess I could give those to Zevran, but he actually, the what he has already is actually better than these for sure. So that's why I didn't give them to him either. Anyway, just let me know. I'm not sure which one would be better because I'm not very good at trying to figure this kind of thing out, to be honest. Anyways, that's the end of today's episode, you guys. Give this video a like because it really helps out the channel. And leave comments down below because I love to chat with you guys about the games. And I will see you in the next one. Until then, remember to play safe, play nice, and have fun. Bye, guys. i